Hello, Don Master here. Now I finally pulled the trigger and got a real drill. These are finally available now in store with the all new Power Pack 8 amp hour battery. And this is the DCD 1007 WW1 with a fast charger. And it's the most powerful cordless drill that they offer. And, uh, yeah, I needed it for uh, heavy drilling and whatnot. We do have a, ma a mag drill at work, but sometimes you can't uh, attach it to certain things. And this will be really nice. It'll come in handy. A lot more power compared to the other drills I own. I already own like four drills, but they're a lot smaller. I needed a real drill with a handle. So we'll get this open, show you what it looks like. So you get the bag, you get a battery, an 8 amp hour, nice rubber bottom on it, state of charge stays, I like that. How long does it stay lit? Goes away. Drill. Look at that beast. She's a pig. Owner's manual. The handle. And the eight amp fast charger. So this is the third one I own. This is a newer version though got the newer writing on it love the DeWalt bag can't ever have enough of them but yeah I'm pretty excited to get this drill I spent probably 45 minutes in the store at Home Depot trying to decide if I was gonna go ahead and spend the $350 on this or wait for it to go on sale but I've been really needing a more powerful drill at work I had to drill a one inch hole in a bracket Friday or Thursday at work and I was struggling with my air drill, my Mac half inch chuck air drill. It kept cutting out. It wouldn't it wouldn't do it. I forced it to do it, but it got it done. I just wasted time. This will just plow through stuff. I'm pretty confident it will. Um this thing is mainly just for large large drilling applications so uh let's get her set up see how she looks with the battery and everything on it there it is with the battery that's a chunker um i've never haven't owned the 999 998 or 996 i've used the 996 so the 996 the 998 and the 999 are basically the same slight power differences but the dimensions are the same they're like this drill, but longer and narrower. They made this drill a lot fatter because it's got more power and it's got a bigger transmission. And they've added the Perform Protect and I Twist, which you could probably see it kick in on my YouTube short video. If it, if it binds up and it starts to twist, it cuts off. So that's cool. Anyway, with this drill, the videos I watched if you use a regular 5 amp hour or smaller, if you don't use this power pack, 8 amp hour, or like a really high output battery, you're not going to achieve the maximum torque as I've seen in the videos. Torque Test Channel tested this um, with the regular 5 amp hour battery, maybe a power stack. They didn't have this battery, but I know based on the videos I've watched, this 8 amp hour power pack battery... Um, gives it a lot more power now I tested this did a little video drilling through some wood with an inch and a half uh, spaddle bit and I had my six amp hour um, older DeWalt battery on it and it did great but I'm curious to see how much power this has because this battery is dead so it was on the charger when I first tested this drill but it's a hammer drill and uh, 3,800 blows per minute, or 3,800 
2000 or 250 and then drilling mode 450 on speed one 1200 speed two 2000 on speed three and then it bumps up the rpm if you have it in hammer mode and uh, it's got a really nice chuck in there carbide teeth this ring on the front kind of looks funny i'm not sure what that is for the older models didn't have that um, but this is a nice drill i like that it has a three-speed transmission and um just looks really good well well designed it is pretty heavy with this eight amp hour pack but um, it's not going to be used to do small holes and stuff it's mainly just drilling heavy doing heavy work and you don't have to use the handle uh, unless you're doing big stuff because it has the anti-rotation um, see it says right there I can probably get it to kick in yeah if you twist it you can trick it watch and then the light comes on so if it senses a quick jolt it'll shut down keep you from getting injured um, the other cool thing about this new drill see it's still the light turns red when it goes into kick kick mode there we go so you got light modes you can leave the light off you can have this on and then 20 minutes it actually makes the light a little bit brighter so normal 20 minute and then this light rotates which is pretty cool it's a nice drill so i'm pretty happy i got it it was a lot of money but for the kit 350 dollars for it being brand new isn't bad you can get the bare tool for 250 249 the kit is 349 but for a hundred dollars more you're getting a 230 dollar or 220 dollar battery because home depot uh, the one by my place here they had these batteries for sale in one packs and two packs whoa, 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 and a one whoa. pack was 220 i think and the two pack was like 400 or something crazy but think about that if you bought this and you didn't have this battery eventually you'd probably go buy this battery so you'd spend a lot more than just buying the kit plus you get this cool fast charger with the fan it's awesome so anyway that's all i got 1007 compared to sizing to some other drills okay Compared to the first drill I bought, a cordless drill for at work, was the MCD971 Metal Chuck Mac. This is basically a DeWalt, just a little bit nicer. Um, it's got the screens in here. You can see the size difference. Just girthy. Look at that size difference. Anyway, that's the new guy. I'm excited to see how this battery is. I'm going to put it on the 961, see how it works on the impact wrenches. So, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and have a good one.